What is this? This? Has a distinctively inhuman appearance to it. I guess I need to put rocks on this? Oh my! What are we doing way out here? We're not starting at the base, and we're not starting at the base for good reason! We got a lot of work to do. Oh. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, wait. Give me that. There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyways. So, I've been out exploring, because like I said, I needed some more areas to examine, and we found... Boar skin. I've got actually three. So the, one of the things I made was a rock bag. And um, there's additional things we can make. We can make a spear bag and a warm suit. But I'm going to need a lot more to make the warm suit. I also don't recognize one of the skins. I, I guess I just haven't encountered the creature yet. But um, I need to be on the lookout for ropes. Because basically I need two more ropes. Because I got one. We got the cloth. And I got the, uh, the deer. Well, no, I'm going to need one more deer skin. Anyways... What are we doing out here? Well, if we take a look at my map, I think you could see that I've been exploring like crazy, trying to find more stuff to make episodes on. And wouldn't you know it? Turns out, looking around, seek and you shall find. And I marked it right over there. Didn't actually take a look inside of it, but that's where we're going to go head on over. And as you can see, we're actually going to have to go into the ice area or the the snowy part of um, the biome, so now we know we're definitely in a cold climate. And um, as soon as I go in here, you're going to find that I start to have cold problems. Look at that, you can already see you're cold and wet, you know, get to a fire to dry off, etc. Um, I believe there is a way to counter that. Like, let me take a look at my inventory. Can't I make... Um where, oh, okay, I already have them. Where are my rabbit? Oh, here we go. Rabbit fur boots? No, nope, looks like it's not enough. So I know that you can actually equip different items in order to do better in the snow. But here's the main thing why it's really not that big of a deal. You see how I've got 129 cloth? I could just do this. And light this on fire and use it as both a torch and as a source of heat. So you could already see the message down on the bottom left is gone. It, it's not even really that big of a deal. I mean, it would be more convenient because then I wouldn't have to worry about needing this burning. Like it might be annoying if I were to get into combat because swinging around a burning item will cause it to go out sooner. But here we go, this is it right here. As you can see, we have found The, the nose of the plane. You guys doing okay in there? Yeah, they're, they're fine. Don't, don't worry about it. I know some of you guys are freaking out that, you know, this guy is, um... You know, he's just having a nap. It's not a big deal. Nothing to freak out over. What's this? Ah, some swag YOLO clothing. No, thank you. Don't need it. Ah, uh, ooh. The flare gun. What's this? Definitely real. TV star's wife dies. Okay, I'm not sure what all that's about. He's just, um... He's, look at, look at the way his teeth look. He's actually having fun. He's just like, oh, this is like the... This is the funniest game show ever or something. He's like, what, what, ah, ah, ah. So it's, it's not that big of a deal. This guy, he's just on break. I will come back and, and just get him out of there and everyone is going to be saved. I'm going to save everyone. It's not even a big deal. It's what Fox does. Uh, I believe I'm going to leave this here. But, you know, for this being this crazy, like, snow area, to be off, honest, I didn't really find anything else here. <laughs> That's just the thing. Like, um, it really wasn't as interesting as I thought it would be. I thought it was going to be this whole extra crazy biome. Uh, it, it it feels a little bit incomplete, to be honest. But, um... 
Oh, I guess that's Timmy. Kind of a creepy looking kid, to be honest. Definitely real weekly. Exclusive. TV star's wife dies. The tragic accident exposed. Um, because this is supposed to be us, apparently. Like, that's my character, and that's Timmy. So, I guess we're, we're, we were a TV star or something. Beats me. Anyways, let's talk about the next objective we're heading to. So now that we're all the way to the north, of course the most convenient thing would be to go all the way down to the southwest. And that's exactly what Fox is going to do, because we have more loot, we've got more things which to profit off of. You know, like, other people's misfortune is Fox's profit. And that's exactly where I am heading to right now. We're gonna go get some profit, and I'm gonna see you there. And here we are! We actually got two entrances. I believe there's one here, and if I bring up the map, I think there's another one nearby as well. My guess is that they're probably part of the same cave system. What? Wait, what's this? There are apparently blueberries inside of the rock. Or maybe the rock is actually a giant blueberry. I have no idea. Okay, so this is the climb down one. I prefer the squeeze through ones. I believe the squeeze through one is just right over here. I want to try this one. Maybe I'll get lucky and they're actually going to be different cave systems. That would be pretty sweet, but... I mean, I guess they could be. I mean... Oh, I just have to destroy these real fast. I just love destroying these things. It's really sad. Oh, I didn't want to destroy that bush, though. That was a twin berry bush. Although, right now, I'm full on twin berries. So let's go ahead and mark this as we have been in it with the white marker. Stupid bird. Okay, anyways, here we go, boys. We are heading in. New cave system. New cave system means possibly new threats. I did get fortunate, and I did find some, um... Some more batteries. Uh, I'm still... Not at the best shape with batteries, so I'm definitely hoping that we find some batteries along the way. In fact, I might even just... Let's just stick with the, um... Let's just stick with this right now, I think. Because I, I actually think the, the torch is not too bad. Yeah, that, that's still giving us pretty good light. Very different, though, with the, you know, the incandescent warm orange glow. And this light is comfortable, but the one thing that the flashlight has an advantage without a doubt is... Okay, someone's obviously here. Let me pull my flashlight out. As I was saying, one of the advantages of the flashlight is we could see much farther. Hey, boys! You guys doing okay? Into battle! You will suffer for... ...living in your cave that I'm invading. That is why you will suffer. I don't care if it's your home. It is now my home, and I chop your meat. One more, just to be safe. Really? Your awkward fighting style. Where'd he go? Oh, he's like hitlocking me. Stop doing that. That's cheating. Only I can hitlock you. Now I chop your face. Okay. Okay, I got kind of turned around by all this. Where am I? I need to find out where we started. I'm pretty sure this is it. Okay, because we don't want to miss any of the side paths. Let me, let me go back a little bit farther. Because we don't want to miss any side areas. Because I'm, I'm always missing stuff. There's always more treasure to find. I'm missing. Okay, I feel comfortable now. So what we're going to do is start marking some areas. Actually, I need to eat a dry fish. I said eat a dry fish. God. Come on, game. Okay, I thought that might have been a, a side path. Let's go ahead and light a torch up so that we can save a little bit here. Come on. Light up. There we go. Save a little bit of batteries. Yeah, we got people's arms. Is this where the, the arm guy comes from? Do they just gather a bunch of arms and slap them together and you get an arm guy? 
What have we here? Ooh, lots and lots and lots. Well, not lots and lots and lots, but a decent amount. Is this a rope? <laughs> Please don't tell me that that is the, 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 what I was talking about. Please tell me that is not the location. Let me get the flashlight out so I can see if these pathways lead separate directions. Mm. I want to say no. I think it just kind of goes in a circle, but let me hop up here real quick. Yeah, okay, it goes in a circle. Let's let's just mark this just uh, for my own sanity. Which was actually low. Wait, I don't need to build it. I, did, I just need to do that. Turn the flashlight off, and we'll climb up and see where this pathway leads. As I was saying, uh, yeah, all the caving that we were doing earlier was actually killing my sanity. I, I was down to like 60%. I had to spend like, I think, two in-game days just kind of chilling out and doing like normal activities in order to restore the sanity back to like normal. Don't entirely know what low sanity does, but I swear I hear things when I have low sanity. Yeah, this has got to be that location. Check the map. Yep, okay. So these locations are literally right next to each other. Not sure why they would be built that way, but they are. Most important- wait, 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 wait. Okay, that's what I thought when I turned you when I change your color you better listen to me boy or We're gonna have a problem. We'll have words about it Now that I've learned the fast slide down technique. Oh my god. It's so much easier All right bring this out light it up And we're good to go Is this a wait? I'm getting turned around, aren't I? Okay, I'm pretty sure this is the correct way. Wait. Wait. No! No, 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 no. This is the correct way. These ju these are just respawns. Could you technically, like, farm materials just by doing that? Or- Okay, I'm getting super confused now. Fox is getting thrown for a loot, boys. Okay, no, 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 no. Okay, I made- I remember this because I made a joke about it. The jokes help you get mental notes, but this has got to be the correct way. Thought I heard someone in here besides me. That's one thing I don't like about low sanity. When you have low sanity, you start to hear things. This guy has radio equipment on, so he must be a pilot. But I don't know if he's necessarily a pilot of... ...of the plane that we're on. That's not necessarily the case, because remember, there's also the crashed helicopter. I could really use some... ...batteries? I'd feel much better if I had my full, my full suite of batteries. Oh, wow. Someone legs. Wait. Okay, yeah, I thought, that, I thought it looked like kind of like wood. Like, I like how they're just kind of sitting here like this, like, I'm just, uh, waiting for the next-gen consoles to come out, and then, like, <laughs> he got, like, half of his body removed. What's this? A giant black hole? Oh, is that, is that a picture of the, um, the sinkhole? Wow. Where they're trying to keep, like, demons out of here or something? They got, like, crucifixes. I wonder- I, I feel a little bit worried because of that door. I think I'm gonna pull out the plastic torch. Which is the flashlight. Let's try out the flare gun. Try it again. Come on, the flare gun needs to just stick. I see you guys, you wanna come and fight? Ok, 
Okay, I was wondering if there'd be some kind of a weird enemy. Oh my god, this is gonna be a really awkward fight, I can already tell. It's gonna be a super awkward fight. I really hate when they do that weird hissing, like, yeah! Oh crap, I did realize I have no armor. That's not good. That means I'm gonna have to use some... Um, Martison. Good thing the game pauses, right? I'm gonna have to be a little more defensive now. Why am I still swinging? Like, I swear that I'm not pushing any buttons. I don't know why I'm swinging downwards, either. Nope. There we go. There we go. You're still alive, aren't you? I can change that. I should have brought some armor. That would have been smart. But I'm not always smart. Sometimes I'm doomed. As long as we don't encounter anything unusual, we should be kind of on the okay side, though. That is my current opinion on things. Look at all this cloth we're getting. That is amazing. The more cloth we can get, the better. You know what we could do? We could just build a fire real quick. Light it up. Not burn our money, because, like I said, we're going to be rich when we're done. And all we got to do is just throw some of these cannibals on here. Where, wherever they went. Where did I get them? We can actually just make a little bit of armor on the, the go right here. Because I actually have plenty of cloth. Like, cloth is not an issue right now. So let's just throw these guys in here. And since I got the stick bag, I can actually carry 20 sticks, so losing 7 of my 20 isn't even that big of a deal. Let's go ahead and pull out our flashlight while they are cooking. Oh, let me see if I can wash off. I think I can wash. This might be enough if I crouch. There we go. Now we're not dirty anymore. Got, gotta be clean. Not because cleanliness has anything to do with, like, hygiene, it's because it just makes you sexier. You know, like, oh my, what have we here? We have a pathway downwards. Let's go ahead and mark this. Let's go ahead and make some armor. Even a little bit of armor helps, honestly. Armor makes, like, a huge difference. What's funny is armor is more like shielding, because, like, they, the, basically the way it works is they don't do any damage to your physical body until they go through your armor, so it's, like, it's pretty much like you've got, like, overshielding on. Boom, boom. There we go. So now we've got, oh, four out of our ten armor filled. That's not bad. Um, you know what? I'm not sure if I want to go down there first. This actually could be a dead end. Flares. A new... Oh, I got... Okay, so if you try to get another flashlight, I've learned that you do get batteries from it. So I guess one way you could restock on ba batteries is just to kind of continuously go in and out of a cave that has... Uh-oh. Reveal your secrets to me. What the hell are those? What are these? Are these hearts? Yeah, I think they're hearts. And that one looks like a lung. Yeah, I think they're hearts and lungs. Wow. I mean, I guess these cannibals are into that whole kind of, like, nose-to-tail diet, if you guys have heard of it. You know, the people who want to eat, like, pretty much every part of the animal. You know, maybe, or maybe it's the other way around. Maybe they are like, oh my god, hearts? That is super gross. Who would ever eat a heart? And maybe they were just kind of disposing of them. You decide. 
You decide, boys. What does this say? Oh. Okay, so that's from the airport or the, um, the plane. So that means that guy is probably a former passenger on... Well, not a former. He's, he's, still, he's still good. He is a former passenger. I mean, like, the, the plane is no good. I didn't say I'd save the plane. What is this? But I'm going to save him. He'll be fine. Stop panicking. It's, it's all good. Okay, let me go ahead and take a swig of this. No, it's soda. Definitely going for the soda. Soda and berries, like that's the an optimal diet. If you're wondering what you should be eating in a, in a crisis, the answer is soda and blueberries. Wow. Why couldn't, why couldn't it just be one, one rope? Why does it have to be two? Ooh, this one's a little bit longer. All right, we're at the bottom, boys. I think I want both of them right now. I think I want both. No, no, give me the flashlight. Oh, that's what it is. The flashlight's running out of juice. Ugh! Uh, we can live without the juice for a little bit. This is how, like, the 200 IQ explorers go. They use a torch, and they use a flashlight at the same time. Must have 200 IQ to do a wheel to, to redundant light sources. Okay. Oh, I thought you were alive at first. What are you reaching out for? Oh, you have... Rebreather collected? Hold on a second. What did we just get? Rebreather. Swim further underwater. Really? Can I just do that? So can I go underwater now? I mean, I could always go underwater. Can, can I breathe underwater? Oh, man. That is awesome. I think it's awesome, at least. Oh, I still am not a huge fan of being underwater. You know, still PTSD from all those underwater video games I've played as a kid. But wait, but it comes with a light. What? Oh, I can see my breath gauge diminishing already. Are there any underwater monsters in this game? It'll make me sad if the answer is yes. Oh my god, it's like I'm playing Subnautica. It's Subnautica all over again. I'm cold and wet. Didn't I- it, it didn't come with a wetsuit, did it? Really? Really? Okay, I, let's take a- okay, I thought that this might have been the end of the area, but let's just take a pit stop here real quick. Uh, let's warm up. And we got it with this very easy to do like this. Oh! Evil babies! Okay, I think I'm good. Okay, um, let's warm up real quick and we'll experiment with this area, or explore this area rather. We can't carry any more air canisters. That's soda. I recognize the, the brand name on the box now. Snacks! We'll eat a snack. Ah, let's drink a soda and a snack. Might as well. Um, there we go. There we go. I get my soda back. Flares. Oh, can I reload the flare gun?
Did that, did that... Did I just put a whole bunch of them in here? Hold on a second, is that actually working? Is it like eating up my, did, did that just eat up my... No, no, 13. The, what's the capacity on this thing? Can I just put in like a bajillion of them? Eighteen? <laughs> that seems slightly questionable, I must say. How do I how do I get more oxygen? Okay, so I just Okay, so that refills it. Now that's not a waste because we weren't able to pick up this one. Okay, okay, so it works just like the um the chainsaw. Medicine. Are we injured? Let me take a medicine real quick. There we go. Might as well not waste anything. Okay, we got some loser here who probably starved. Back in we go. This is cool. Oh, man. The scuba gear. I mean, like, I wish we had, like, goggles, because, like, it, it's like, I would like, if we had, like, um... Because I'm basically just a guy wearing a rebreather right now. I don't actually, I like, you know, I need to have a wetsuit, I need flippers, you know, I need, um, I need the whole shebang. Wait a second. Why doesn't that just stay on? No! No, why wouldn't that just, that, oh, that would have been so good. That would have been so good if it just stayed on. Um, let's go ahead and just light this torch. That would have been so good. But that probably would have been OP. You would have had, like, an infinite light source. Really? More of these? Okay, so all we gotta do is just cram one of these in there, and then we can just pick more of these up. It's like, not, you know, like, might as well not waste it. What's the harm in it? It just takes a button push or two. What is this? This... has a distinctively inhuman appearance to it. I guess I need to put rocks on this? Oh, this is giving me such an ominous feel. It's like Indiana Jones or something. Oh, this is so weird. I guess we're going in, boys. I guess we're going in. I don't know if I want to go in. I don't know if I like that idea. We're going in, boys. And we're going to use our 200 IQ. Like, wait, I need to reload the batteries. There we go. No! I said reload! There you go. There we go. I guess we're going in. We'll take a look at that in a moment. What is happening here? What are in these boxes? Old gun ammunition. These boxes are empty. What good were they? Soda. Wow. What's this? It's a Bible. But what version is it? Is it the Dewey Rhymes version? That's an important detail. Like, you, you know, it's like, why don't you just open it up and look at the author? Who's... Ver oh. Another Bible, wow. Um, I didn't want to switch. Thank you very much. Oh, here we go. Let's turn this on, and then we can... save a little bit of battery power. Uh, do I need to reload? Let's see. Yeah, I'll take one. 
Same thing right here. Let's go ahead and reload this. Looks like I didn't need to. Ooh, rope. Ro rope a dub a dub dub. Oh, I need another deer skin. Oh. What's this? One of those, like, spaginer girls. What's this? Rusty axe? Is that a new weapon? Rusty axe. It can't be as good as the modern axe. No. This thing's way better. Like, why would you ever want Rusty Axe? Were we, were, were we supposed to find the Rusty Axe first? Is that what it's implying? No, oh, give me it! Remember, boys, we're, we're always looking for profit first. If we're profiting, then we're winning. Alright, let's see what this is. That is a ton of Bibles. Need a little more light. So these guys are... The way they're posed, I, it almost feels like something happened to them. I mean, it, the, if you starved to death down here, or froze to death, it, I feel like you wouldn't freeze to death like that. I'm not an expert on freezing to death, you know, having, you know, not, not undergone freezing to death before. I'm just saying that, based on my... Like, well, this guy here, it look, he looks like he's, like, emerging out of the water, and then he was just like, Oh, I ran out of batteries. <laughs> And then he died. It's my opinion. I have no idea. Let's continue on, I guess? Is that a food tray or something? Where, where does this go? This is weird. I, I don't- I don't- I'm not sure what I was expecting in this episode. But it wasn't this. It wasn't this. Man, this would be, like, literally, like, just absolute darkness, if not for the lighting that we got from this, the, uh, the scuba gear. To-do list updated. Well, can I... Somebody tells me I can't look at my to-do list underwater. Yeah, I just tried it. Don't know where I'm going. No, we are completely submerged right now. Okay, so there's no... It just means continue forward. That's all it means. To be honest, I'm not worried about drowning just because we have so many O2 tanks. And honestly, the O2 tanks give us a decent amount of oxygen. Like, somehow they're more advanced than the ones in Subnautica. And what the Subnautica, like, the best one gives me, like, 130 seconds of air. Like, this one's, like, super, like... This is- this must actually be insane alien technology. Apparently I'm freezing. Let's change that real quick. Light it up. Bunch of sticks. And, um... Check the notebook, I guess. Let's see what the notebook says, boys. Okay, we obviously crossed something on. What do I, which one do I re not recognize? Dead, hanging, hanging, submerged, cave. That one sounds the most realistic. Like, I don't remember submerged. And this does feel like a submerged cave, so I guess we just hit the submerged cave, boys. Let's keep climbing. I don't know where this is gonna go. Like, I don't know where any of this goes. Like, the dude, that was so wild. Like, we found some kind of, like, insane, like, alien entrance. Like, this game is full of surprises. I mean, like, I'm assuming it's alien. You know, like, I don't know. It could have just been, like, an advanced proto-civilization or something. I don't know. Or some kind of advanced, like, precursor. I don't even know. Don't, don't look at me, boys. If you're looking for me for answers, I am the wrong person. I have no idea what's going on. 
Need some more fish though, and drink some water. And we're going back in. Now with the ability to explore underwater, what possibilities does this open up to us? Obviously allows us to explore underwater, but one thing it means is if we want to escape enemies, we are capable of just going into the water. Not even a big deal now. Oh, it's so weird and dark underwater. I don't like it. Looks like I'm getting cold, too. We'll just have to deal with that. I thought that was going to be an entrance, but... Please tell me there's a way up here. Oh! Is this a vertical squeeze-through? What? What? Ducks? What? Where, where am I? Excuse me, ducks. What? Where am I? Where's the map at? I'm not that far away from my home. Which is right over there, hmm. Oh, now I recognize this place, now that I see the two little watchtowers. What? There was a cave underground this entire time? I had no idea. That is nuts. I mean, is it a good idea just to take it off? Like, can't I just leave it on? Let's see how close I am to my base. Like, does that- that means- that cave was here this entire time, and I just had no idea that I could just, like, swim downwards into, like, that cave system? That's crazy! And what about that, um... That crazy doorway, like, what the heck was... What was the point of that doorway? It didn't even, like, lead to anything. It wasn't like it was, like, guarding some kind... Yeah, look at this. We're not even that far away from our base. Like, I made it there in one, in one sprint of stamina. Well, in visual range of it, in one sprint of stamina. It's like, I thought that that was gonna, like, lead to some kind of, like, Legends of the Forbidden Temple or something. It's like, it, it didn't even lead to anything. Yeah, here we are back at the base. Like, wow. That's crazy. Like, I don't even know now. Like, I do know there's another cave that I've detected. Maybe I should have marked that as, a, as an entrance. But yeah, there's actually another cave. We should be able to see it. Yeah, see that purple marker? Let me see what direction I'm looking in. We're looking southwest or northwest. Yeah, so northwest of the the um, the the cave in the sinkhole, I found another one. So, oh, there's another one there. Maybe I don't know which them, which one that. They they might be connected to the same system. Who knows? But there you go. Like I guess we got some new stuff. Like we found the the cockpit of the the plane and the scuba gear. So I guess I'll start exploring underwater a bit. You know, and I'll make a video if I find anything. Anyways, let me know what you think down in the comment section. I guess we found a creepy alien doorway or whatever the heck that was. Like, Indiana Jones doorway. But, uh, yeah, I have no idea what to make of that. Anyways, let me know what you think down in the comment section. Like this video is intended to subscribe for future The Forest content. And, of course, remember that you don't have to be good to get good.